Hello and welcome back to another video on Sea of Thieves. In the last video, I became a pirate legend. <coughs> Shameless plug. So what is it that bored pirate legends do in their free time? There's a two-word answer to that. The hunter's call. So earlier on today, I set off on a grand adventure to do some fishing. My plan was to go to the ancient gold fortress fish for as long as possible, and then sell at the nearest sea post. A good reason for this is that fortresses have a four pan cooker, allowing me to cook four times faster than I would on my regular ship. On a side note, this took place on season 11's community weekend, meaning I got double gold and reputation for everything I did today. Which is good, as I only started at level 18 Hunter's Call. Upon arrival at the fort, I quickly cleared it of all the phantoms and made it my new home for the next couple of hours. After setting up my supply crates, I quickly got to fishing. About an hour later, I got extremely bored and decided I was going to start cooking. After a brief segue to start cooking, I decided I should probably start selling before I got bored and ate some worms. So, upon arrival at the sea post, I began selling to Derek, who if you don't know, was a fan suggestion because someone made their pirate look like Merrick and the game implemented it. I gained literally a level and a half. So, I came up with a better idea. Something less time consuming, but more fun. A treasury. I arrived at said destination and dived below the waves to find what terrors awaited me there. Surprisingly, it was pretty easy. Upon clearing it, I played my way into a treasure to go find my mermaid gem. Mermaid gems come in a range of rarities, blue, green and red, in ascending order. Blue grants the least amount of golden reputation, then green, then red. So I was happy upon collecting my loot to have found I had two blue one green, and one red, the highest rarity. Triumphant, I played my way back to the sea post, where I was going to sell my gems again. This is a prime example in Sea of Thieves, where sometimes doing something for a little less time, and a little bit out of, outside the box, gets you far more golden reputation. And there you have it. Only a tiny amount of time spent compared to the hour of fishing netted me a solid half a level, opposed to the two I got for nearly four times the time. Also, it was far less brain rotting. As you can clearly see, I got to level 20, which is a lot, and gained a large amount of guild reputation as well, which I'm sure the guild master, the pirate lord, will be happy about. So thank you, and see you all next time. Goodbye.